Good afternoon, everyone. Magandang hapon sa inyong lahat. Okay, so are you, are you ready to know how to win the 100,000 pesos cash prize? Okay, sabi nga ng secretary, um, make it light, make it fun. Okay, so I'm here to explain to you the competition mechanics of the fourth Indiciencia Filmmaking Competition. Okay, here we go. The competition comes in four stages. We are now in stage one. As we have opened the uh, competition today, we now are calling for film entries from everyone. And the stage two, the second stage, would be the submission of film entries on the deadline on or before the deadline, as we have uh, as we have seen it in the ADP before. Stage three would be judging and screening by the film jury. And uh, earlier on, uh, we have presented to you the judges, uh, which includes our uh, distinguished college secretary of the uh, graduate school of the UP Los Baños, uh, Dr. Aina Dupo. We have also uh, Professor Seymour Sanchez of the College of St. Benil of De La Salle and also of FDU and Mapua, uh, University, and Mapua Institute of Technology. And yours truly from uh, Department of Science and Technology, SEI. Stage four would be the awarding of winners sometime in January or I know, a March or April, right? I mean, in February next year, we'll have to announce that. The call for uh, film entries uh, would uh, be for those who are Filipinos, maybe students or non-students, teachers, filmmakers, scientists, researchers, and other professionals in the country. There are two categories. One is a youth category, which is open to high school and tertiary students and out of school youth aged 30 to 20 years old. You will have to declare that in the entry form. The second category, which is separate, the open category, is open to science communication specialists, teachers, filmmakers, scientists, engineers, researchers, and other professionals. So, if you're over 20 years old, you are doing something else, not really science, or maybe science, you can join and team up with filmmakers. How to join? The entry should be science-based and adhering to the theme, Communities Beyond the Naked Eye. I repeat, Communities Beyond the Naked, the naked Eye. That means something you cannot see. So it could be about microorganisms, it could be about insects, it could be about processes, it can be about living or non-living things. It, it can be about virtual networks, communities that you don't normally see every day, but exist. So the film that you're expecting from the uh, entries or the uh, applicants should be documentary films. You can have some animation or some drama inside a documentary film. The total running time should not exceed 10 minutes, okay? It can be less but it cannot be more than 10 minutes, including opening and closing billboard. We suggest that you use original soundtrack and uh, if ever that you will be using anything that will, will be included there, you have to uh, cite your sources or even uh, put it in the credits. Language to be used should be English, Filipino, or any regional language, provided that if you do not use English, you should have English subtitles. Why? Because we also uh, encourage the winners to uh, submit their uh, films to the Science Film Festival, uh, which is being held uh, every year all over the world. And this is uh, organized by the Gilde Institute in Bangkok. So the winners would normally be included in the screenings of the science films all over the world. Film entries should be submitted in any of the following file formats. DVD, AVI, or ABI, MP4, MO, or MOB, or FLB. Remember, total running time is 
10 minutes and the use of the soundtrack. Next slide. You have to fill up the entry form through any of the links below. So you, can, you can find, you can download the entry forms through the sites or the links uh, shown on screen. And uh, of course, the entry forms, the uh, accomplished entry forms should be submitted together uh, with the film. And that can be uh, online, right? Or if you want, you can have it delivered as well to SEI DOST. The deadline for submission, as I've said, is January 15, 2020. So where to submit your film? It may be sent by courier to DOST, SEI, or by Dropbox, as shown on the screen. Again, we have to emphasize that the organizers and judges reserve the right to reject entries deemed to contain obscenity, nudity, and violence. Okay? So that's uh, very clear. Hanggat mare, walang masyadong violent at yung mga hindi rin tinatanggap ng MPRCD, hindi rin natin tatanggapin kasi maaaring ipakita rin natin sa telebisyon ang inyong mga pelikula. The Board of Judges will evaluate all the submitted film entries to select the finalists and winners in both categories. So we only have one set of jury. So we have introduced the judges uh, earlier on. So there